What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Ben. So today we have another iOS 17.5 update. You can see if I go to the software update page, this is not showing up. And if you're experiencing such or a similar issue and you have your beta updates profile set to developer or public beta, go in there and then put the developer beta updates to off just like this. And then if you go back, you see the update shows up again so you can refresh this page just to make sure and you can see this is ios 17.5.1 it's available in less than a week after ios 17.5 was released and it's here with important bug fixes and addresses a very important bug that was here where some photos that were deleted way, way back on an iPhone that you might have sold or you might have laying around and update to iOS 17.5, those photos would come back. So it's here to resolve that. And now just to show you here on my other device that this is gonna be pretty similar. If you go here where it says um, general and go to software update, Give it a moment. This one, even though it's on the developer beta, you can see the software update shows up, iOS 17.5.1, and the update size is 274.2 megabytes updating from iOS 17.5. So I'll just quickly take a screenshot and then do the software update so that we can see what's changed with this update just like that and our device is now up to date you can see your iphone has been updated to ios 17.5.1 right here now if we go into the settings and then go to general and go to software update you can see we are now up to date with ios 17.5.1 just looking at the build number that comes with this update right here you can see it there it's 21f90 so it's been updated and the main thing that Apple is addressing when it comes to this device has to do with some bugs that users have reported, but the most important one has to do with photos where different users might have photos that are two to three years old that they deleted, but for some apparent reason, those photos would reappear on the device. And Apple mentioned that this is very rare and in fact it is rare in the photos because i reached out to a number of people to see if they were experiencing any of this issue where some of their photos whether it's in the deleted folder or it's in the recent folder would reappear i haven't found anyone that i know personally that was affected by this but if you had a pictures that you deleted from a device and you restored the defaults and restored it to factory it would still affect the device meaning that if you have a device you wiped clean and sold it on facebook marketplace or craigslist or wherever this could happen to a device that you previously used to own and yes some news articles mentioned that even nudes like photos that you probably don't want to share would reappear as long as they were taken two to three years ago so that seems to be a big issue that users were experiencing and you can see how swift and fast apple was able to update this now overly the update itself updated pretty good the performance or the heat rather of the device is pretty much normal and it's expected for such a small update that's in the 200 megabytes and Another thing that I wanted to highlight when it comes to this photos issue, well, from what I've seen as well and heard from uh, different sources online is that it's affecting users who did not have photos stored in iCloud. So if that's something that you use and you haven't backed up your photos, you can do that and then maybe you'll be exempt in a way, but if you want to update to this a software update ios 17.5.1 is here and it's here to fix this photos issue among other bug fixes that apple hasn't yet disclosed i'll be testing it out to see what it is and how the overall device performance is but in terms of like security patches or security updates when it comes to ios 17.5.1 you can see here the latest we still have is ios 17.5 and ipad os 17.5 for all these devices it was released on may 13 so as of now at the time i'm recording this we haven't got any newer updates but 
with time apple does tend to update and let users know if there is any cve entries or common vulnerabilities and exposures that apple has resolved so if you know someone that has an older device of yours and you are uh, worried that something that you used to have on your device might reappear after they update to iOS 17.5, then you can let them know to update to iOS 17.5.1, which will fix that issue. This should basically serve as a lesson to different users to not take pictures or share images or videos of things that they wouldn't share. Otherwise, as you can see, the memory is just an address and it's overridden by ones and zeros and so on and it can always be recovered in a way so don't take pictures of things that you're not proud of or that you wouldn't be confident sharing elsewhere because things like this happen and when they do a lot of users are affected so that's about it for me guys when it comes to ios 17.5.1 let me know if you'll be updating and uh, if i was you and if i was worried about some of the leaks or some of the issues that it's here to resolve then this is definitely one of the updates to update your devices to so stay safe and i'll see you in the next one peace